good morning grade eight students welcome to our class today and our topic is adjectives so all of you open your workbooks page number 36 so here we can discuss about adjectives general question what is an adjective already definition is given in the workbook but if you think it describes or modifies a noun or a pronoun in a sentence what is an adjective it describes or modifies a bit of changes for what for nouns and pronouns in a sentence it seems and one more thing we have to remember is it normally indicates quality size shape duration feelings contents and more about a noun or a pronoun means like uh, uh <clears throat> they provide relevant information about the nouns and pronouns they refers to adjectives because our topic is that they modify describe by answering the questions what kind how many which one how much these questions will be answered with adjective adjectives enrich your writing by adding precision and originality to it no doubt in it Uh, let us uh, move on to the example i love that car okay but which one to express it to enrich it i love that red car see that red car demonstrative adjective there and showing the color of it one more example i have 10 candies in my pocket i have candies in my pocket means okay but we are specifying how many i have 10 candies in my pocket now one more example we can take for what kind the team has a batsman naturally a cricket team will have a batsman or some of them will be all rounder but here what kind in the sense the team has a dangerous batsman here dangerous indicates the kind if he was there our whole team will be lost the opponent team may think so what kind of a personality in the team and the other example for how much i earn money that he does okay everyone will be sacrificing their work for their family here how much i earn more money than he does we are comparing here more money more is a comparative adjective or comparative degree also we can come in the next classes degrees of comparison now let us go to our workbook examples here an adjective gives clarity to a sentence sneha is carrying a green bag what type of bag a green bag the project was a huge success how much success huge success okay and uh, my friend manju is a dancer means okay famous dancer it is giving adjective here famous dancer and there were tall trees and lovely flowers in the park and now let's move on to the forming adjectives naturally we can form adjectives from nouns and verbs by what suffixes and prefixes suffix and prefix prefix in the sense adding before a word suffix adding at the end of the word like adding some suffixes like uh, f u l less like y l y i s h i a n i c a l i v e r y able T L and O U S. These are the words, letters used at at back of the words like care. If you take a noun care, add F U L careful. Act. If you take the verb act, then I V E active. Child. If you take the noun I S H childish. Like this, we can go ahead with this <coughs> forming adjectives. 
children one thing we have to observe here we can add similes also what is a simile means it's a phrase which compares two different things having a common quality we use the word like or as to make the comparison understood here given the example the sun is like a golden orange in the sky so he is always as cool as a cucumber so here some exercise is also given for us to work with the similes right so tomorrow we can discuss about degrees of comparison